to Katie's Playtime and so today I'm going to show you how to make a tie-dye butterfly with beautiful tie-dye wings, a furry body and googly eyes. So come with me and let's have some fun. So what you'll need for your activity today is some scissors, some furry pipe cleaners, some googly funny eyes, wooden pegs, some textures, baby wipes, it doesn't matter what brand, just get whatever you can get your hands on, a hair dryer and some rubber bands. So let's get started. So the first thing you need is your baby wipe. So we need one baby wipe and then what we need to do is we need to put our finger in the, the middle of it and then we need to tie a rubber band around so it looks like a ghost. <laughs> so what we'll do is we'll just get our rubber band and we'll just tie that into a little tight knot as tight as we can. Okay, so once we've done that, we now have the rest of this to do. So, you can't do a mistake in this activity. All you need to do is grab your rubber bands, you need to grab bits and sections of your uh, baby wipe, and you just wanna make lots and lots of ties all the way around the baby wipe. So, let's go ahead and do that. So what we have here is a baby wipe and lots of rubber bands tying it into a weird kind of bundled shape. So once you've done that, you need to use your textures. And what we're going to do is just choose whatever colour that you like the best and we're going to colour in sections of our baby wipe. So let's get colouring. While you're colouring in your baby wipe, use the rubber bands as a guide so then that way you know where to colour. So basically we're just going to colour in the middle of each rubber band section. Using different colours of course. I'm not even colouring it in properly, I'm just going to run the texture over it and leave some white bits. That will give us a nice creative effect. And remember, wherever our rubber bands are, that's going to stay white. So you're going to have a great combination of colours in our butterfly today. finish colouring your wet wipe, we're now going to dry it with the hair dryer. So just keep drying it until you think that it's 100% dry. So once the wet wipe is dry and the textures are dry too, we can now undo the rubber bands. So let's start undoing all the rubber bands on our wet wipe. If you have trouble, you can always just cut it with some scissors, which I might just do that. Just make sure you don't cut the wet wipe. And just be careful not to cut yourself. Okay, and then we're gonna carefully undo it. Now I can see that my ink is still a little bit wet still because it's going on my fingers, but luckily I'm using textures that are washable so you can wash it off your fingers really well, so that's fine. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to open it all up and then I'm going to use my hair dryer again just to give it a quick extra dry. Wow, that is one cool tie dye. So 
This is how we make our tie-dye baby wipe. But we're making a tie-dye baby wipe butterfly today. So the next step is to grab one of your wooden pegs. So using our wooden peg, we're now going to place it in the center of our cloth. So what we need to do is bunch it so it's like a bow. So it's like that. And we're then going to peg it in the middle. And you want to make sure that the wings are nice and even and they're sitting quite pretty. And then we're going to get some pipe cleaners. So we're going to use some pink and some yellow, which will be nice. And we're just going to tie them around the peg to give it some colour. And the best thing about the pipe cleaners is that you can tie them on and you can untie them back off if you want to and reuse them. But not only that, you don't have to use glue. Okay, so now we've got our pipe cleaner in the centre. We've got our tie-dye baby wipe as the wings and now we just have to apply the, um, the eyes. And if you do have some Elmer's glue handy, definitely use that or any type of glue at home and choose your eyes that you would like. And we're just gonna do a dollop here and a dollop there. And remember Elmer's glue does dry clear, so that's good. So there's our butterfly with beautiful tie-dye wings, fairy centre and googly eyes. So we can go flying with this cutie. So what do you think of my tie-dye butterfly? I think it's quite cute and I can fly this around the house. Look at it go, it's so cute. So you can do this any colour you like and just have fun with it. It's so much fun just colouring the baby wipes because they're already wet. You've got plenty of them and you can just do as many butterflies or games that you want to do. So I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now. Bye. <laughs>